welcome to St. Mary's Now, a partnership between the Enterprise Newspaper and the Forest Center TV Video Production Program. I'm Raymond Graham. And I'm Callie Ryan. And here's the latest news from the Enterprise. Residents of St. Mary's are recycling less solid waste. The Maryland Department of the Environment has reported a 4% drop from 2016 to 2017. According to county officials, it has now cost more to recycle solid waste than it does to send it to a landfill. St. Mary's residents who live within the bounds of a resource conversation areas may now build private landing strips on their property, the St. Mary's commissioners voted Tuesday. Residents who wish to construct private airports must get conditional use approval from the Zoning Board of Appeals before getting a permit from Land Use and Growth Management. The popular Potomac tourist destination Mallows Bay is poised to become Maryland's first national marine sanctuary by the end of 2019. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration have submitted a 300-page management plan and environmental impact statement that will be available to the public in Federal Register starting Friday. After publication, Governor Larry Hogan will have 45 days to review and make changes to the NOAA's plan. Valerie Hammond, a Choptagon High School graduate and UMBC junior, won the America East Conference Tournament along with claiming UMBC a spot in the NCAA tournament for this year. Hammond regularly visits the county during the summer and helps coach the summer leagues for Choptagon and other local middle and high school softball teams. In late April, Brock Burtz was hired as the head football coach at McDonough High School. Burtz said, I was excited to get the head coaching job at McDonough. They're a small school and our whole schedule is playing bigger schools, but I like a challenge. The first two games they will be playing this season are Chopticon and St. Charles. Burtz commented on this saying, I have a lot of good times playing for Chopticon. We always had good football teams and I also played basketball and baseball there, but I've always wanted to be a head football coach. I'm really looking forward to the opportunity. This news brief has been provided by the Enterprise. For more details, visit somdnews.com. That's all we have for you today on this edition of St. Mary's Now. I'm Raymond Graham. And I'm Callie Ryan. Signing off.